Hey guys, this is Make It Work With Yash, and today we are going to talk about a couple of, um, you know, lures that you use when you go fishing. Me, myself, I like to use, um, I use live bait sometimes, but just sometimes I don't want to fool with the mess, so I use my soft plastics or rubbery items. You know, I use either my, my worms, different types of worms, my, uh, you know, one tail, little uh, wiggles, or I like uh, definitely using my lizards, or like my little, I guess something like an octopus. And my main thing I like using is my little frogs. They call them frisky frogs if you go get that type. And I'm going to show you that, uh, you know, to use these items, see, this is the little frog right here. Uh, see it in some light, little bitty. Look just like little baby frogs. Well, uh, to use these items, you're gonna have to use, uh, you can either use just a hook, you know, put a hook through them, or I like to use uh, the ball head jigs. These are jigs, I like to use these. These make things so, so, so much easier. Um, because with using jigs, it gives off a more realistic look. Like it has a little head on it. Let me get one out for you and show you guys. Okay. So here we go. This looks like a little head. It has the eyes and it has one hook. So to use these different items, you can use a jig with it. You can, for instance, like the lizard, you can take it and you just put the hook through, throw it, or you want to definitely put it through the head part. I don't know what I was thinking. You want to put it and you just put it through like that. That way, you know, when the fish go and grab it, and I mean, these are really rubbery. So once they grab it, they're going to gobble it up and that hook is going to catch it. You know, you have your lizard uh, to use for your little frog. It works great for the frog. You pretty much, <clears throat> this little bitty frog, you're going to just take it, put it through the front of like the mouth. And you just push it through. And what you do when you get it halfway through, you do a little twist and it brings the hook out. So then you push it down and it has the head sticking out. That way when it grab that little frog, it's hooked. Uh, you do the same way with your little jigglies. I call them like little octopus. You know, it has little tentacles like that. So pretty much I call it like the octopus. I do it the same way push through the head. This is for people that don't use these jigs, so just show them how to do it. And with these, since they're really super soft, you can push the jig all the way in once you get the hook through. Pull the hook, push this all the way in, and there you go. You got that just like that. Worms, same way. You grab a hook and, you know, just go through the front. And what this is doing is pretty much tricking the the fish. It makes it think it's uh, the really worm or whatever. But what it is, it really catches the attention of the fish faster. And this actually have a hole in it so you can push your jig in all the way. You just have to do a little wiggling. Um, fish, like I said, love anything shiny. So... You know, with that reflection, you see how that reflects? Let me get some light on it. It has like glitter in it, so it reflects and it really catches the attention of the fish. And, you know, I like to use a lot of, of my rubbery lures. You know, that way, don't have to worry about no cleanup, no mess, no whatever, you know, trying to keep the worms or whatever you use, keep them fresh. You just use that and go out. Hey, it does the same thing. 
And, you know, the main thing about this video is just showing you about jigs. Jigs are something that's great to use. You can find many colors and designs. Me, myself, I like using really bright colors like yellow and orange. And, you know, hey, they come out really, really nice for using your rubbery plastic lures. And, you know, you can't go wrong. Well, guys, this is a short video just to let you know what I use when I fish. And if you need any more information, just stay tuned to different videos I'm doing about fishing. Um, and you guys, if you haven't done so, please like, share and subscribe. And please stay safe out there and enjoy yourself. Talk to you guys later.